Stephen Thompson is set to take on the boogeyman that is Shavkat Rachmanov next month when the UFC returns to Las Vegas. While the Wonderboy has had his moments throughout a long career, it's not difficult to see that the aging striker has bitten off way more than he can chew when it comes to the undefeated Uzbekistani. Join us in this video as we break down why Shavkat Rachmanov will smash through Stephen Thompson when the pair meet at UFC 296 in December. Stick around until the end to get our official prediction on the fight. Dana White announced back in September that the undefeated welterweight Shavkat Rachmanov would face against Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. While these two are a single place apart in the rankings, with Shavkat at 5 and Wonderboy at 6, we believe that the Uzbekistani will run through Thompson for a shortcut when the pair meet next month. Shavkat is widely considered by many to be a future champion of the welterweight division, and he is a nightmare matchup for the somewhat delusional Thompson, who thinks he can earn another title shot. Before we get into why we think the Uzbekistani smashes Thompson when they meet next month, let us first consider the advantages he has over Wonderboy. Shavkat stands at 6 foot 1 inches tall, gives him an inch over Wonderboy. He also has a reach advantage of 2 inches. But the most obvious point to consider is that Shavkat's a fresh 28 year old warrior from the harsh mountains of Uzbekistan, and the Wonderboy is a 40 year old veteran who's knocking on the doors of retirement. While there's no doubt Wonderboy is one of the best kickboxers in the UFC, yet, on average, Shavkat lands 4.5 significant strikes per minute compared to 4.2 for Stephen Thompson. Statistically speaking, Thompson is already beaten and we're still a month away from the fight. There's a good chance that Uzbekistani doesn't stand and bang with Wonderboy. I mean, why would he? Four of his five fights in the UFC have ended with him choking an opponent unconscious or extending their limbs beyond the point of no return. The Uzbekistani will have no problem momentarily stopping the flow of blood to Wonderboy's head if it earns him the victory. Shavkat's grappling is widely considered one of the best in the welterweight division and well above the level of Wonderboy. I mean, can we even compare the two? Thompson literally only practices takedown defense and has only defended 64% of takedowns. We can already see the smile on Shavkat's face as he prepares to throw Thompson to the ground. There's no doubt that Shavkat will land takedowns at will and when he decides to go for them. Yet he doesn't pressure wrestle like many of the other European Sambo fighters. Instead, he stalks his prey and wears them down, patiently waiting for the right moment to attack. While Thompson will want to pressure forward with his striking and possibly even get Shavkat against the cage, this will ultimately be his downfall. Shavkat has gained most of his takedowns in the UFC from having his back up against the cage. Yet, even with the unlikely chance that Shavkat decides to stand and bang with the Wonderboy, he has the skills in his arsenal to light up Wonderboy. If Anthony Pettis has the ability to finish Wonderboy, then think about it. What will Shavkat do to him when they meet next month? We, for one, don't think it'll be pretty. But before we give our official prediction, we'd like to mention that each month we do a share out on our channel and all you need to do to enter is comment I subbed in the comment section below so make sure to comment and you'll have a chance of winning as we mentioned before there's just no way the aging wonder boy who was taken down by a finished Tyron Woodley can resist being thrown to the ground and mauled by Shavkat unfortunately Thompson is nothing but a small block in the road for Shavkat on his way to a future title shot in the division the Uzbekistani hasn't heard the final bell in a single one of his five UFC fights, and we think this will be the case again at UFC 296. We believe that Shavkat will be able to break down the aging Wonder Boy and patiently wait for his chance to finish him. This will come by way of a submission in the third round of their fight. 